This is Stephanie from statisticshowto.com. The Kruskal-Wallis test determines whether the medians of two or more groups are different. The null hypothesis is that the population medians are equal. The alternate hypothesis is that the population medians are not equal. The test will tell you if there is a significant difference between groups. However, it won't tell you which groups are different. For that, you'll need a post hoc test. The test has some assumptions. Your variables should have one independent variable with two or more levels as independent groups. The test is more commonly used when you have three or more levels. For two levels, consider using the man with the U test instead. Your dependent variables should be on the ordinal ratio or interval scale. Observations should be independent. In other words, there should be no relationship between the members in each group or between groups. All groups should have the same shape distributions. Our most software like SPSS or Minitab will test for this condition as part of the test. Let's take a look at an example. A shoe company wants to know if three groups of workers have different salaries. We have salaries for women, men and minorities. The first step is to sort the data for all group samples into ascending order in one combined set. Assign ranks to the sorted data. Next, add up the different ranks for each group. Calculate the H statistic. N is the sum of sample sizes for all samples. We have 15. C is the number of samples. We're going to sum three samples. T sub J, the sum of ranks in the ith sample. For example, for women, the sum of ranks was 44. And N sub J is the size of the jth sample. All of our samples have five items. We get an H of 6.72. Next, find the critical chi-square value with C minus 1 degrees of freedom. We have three groups, so that's two degrees of freedom and an alpha level of 0 0.05. The critical chi-square value is 5.991. Finally, we compare the H value to the critical chi-square value. If the critical chi-square value is less than H, reject the null hypothesis that the medians are equal. In this case, 5.991 is less than 6.72, so you can reject the null hypothesis. Thanks for checking in, and I'll see you in the next video.